Strange by 80s Japanese Goth. This is Pain at Pleasures, and I'm going to rate and review Madame Edwarda. Etranger. Short answer no, I'm not estranged. I couldn't find any lyrics to the song, so if any one of you understands it and uh, can put it out on the internet, that would be greatly appreciated. So we're going to focus only on the song itself, on the things we hear, and that's a damn fine six minute tune. The only thing that I can make out in the song are the points where the singer goes étranger. I think the song is carried by the guitar work and the instrumental part and the vocals are only adjusting to the music. They are playing second fiddle as far as I'm concerned. We get to hear the awesome guitar part over and over again. So when we get to the end of the song after six minutes, you have fallen in love with that part. It's, I think the music is superior to the vocal act. I don't have a lot of experience with 80s Japanese goth acts. So if you're not familiar with it, you might enjoy what you hear. Go and check that out. I rate it as ghastly good. Definitely a recommendation to go and give it a listen. What do you think about it? Are you estranged by the sound? Are you estranged by 80s Japanese goth? Which 80s goth songs from Japan can you recommend? Let me know in the comments down below. Subscribe to the channel. A different opinion is appreciated. Blind love or hatred not. Farewell. It was my pale light pleasure.